Good morning and welcome to Massage Marketing and Business Building and Morning Coffee with me, Susan Bell. And we are going to preface tomorrow's morning coffee with a little bit about the difference between busy, being busy and being productive. And there is a huge difference between being busy and being productive. And I learned this um, especially because I work for myself and I usually work from home. And not many people can do those things or do both of them successfully. And I have for a long, long time. And basically what you do is you have to have the discipline to set yourself up business hours and set yourself up business time and do not mix business with home uh, activities. So I don't spend my business day doing laundry. I don't spend my business day um, doing things at home like vacuuming and such. I spend my business day in my office being, doing business things and being busy. So how can you be busy, ver uh, what is the difference between busy and productive? Well, busy is, of course, and you've heard this a million times, answering email, playing on Facebook, blah, 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 playing with your phone, um, and then being productive um, is something entirely different. So how do we separate the two? So my, my suggestion is, is that you, you get a piece of paper or a planner or something and you block out and let's just do this one time for one hour. So take a task that is something that's productive, whatever it be, and block out a one hour time frame where your phone goes into silent mode and your, um, all your activities go get put away and you focus only on the activity that you've blocked the hour for. So if your goal say is to go through your budget and get all your bills organized, then spend that hour doing only that. If, you're, if your plan is to develop a marketing uh, strategy, then spend all that hour uh, on a marketing strategy, set a timer and spend it only on that. Um, and you'll find that doing a single task for a specific amount of time, you will accomplish more. Another way to do that is also to create a list. So you have a list of things that must be accomplished to be productive. And those lists should not include things like straighten out the envelopes or, you know, count how many black pens I have. Um, it should be something that is productive toward one of your goals. And then check those things off the list. So um, that hour could be spent clearing that list of things that need to be checked off and done prior to um, having, uh, spending some time doing some other things. I do this every morning. I turn my phone off between eight and 10 and um, all my electronics go on the charger and I don't answer the phone and I prepare for my day and plan out my day and, and do what needs to be done on the domestic side as far as getting some bills paid, um, eating breakfast and such, um, things like that out of the way. And then at 10 o'clock I check my phone and return phone calls and answer emails and anything like that and then proceed to do the, the productive things during my day. So find out what time works for you, what all electronics should go off during that time, be productive and then spend some time being busy. Um, busy and productive are not the same thing and we are going to set some productive goals, um, bring them with you for tomorrow's uh, planner uh, morning coffee. See you tomorrow. Have a great day. Bye-bye.